What up, people? Ring the Legendary. Welcome back to 80's Mini Rest of Returns. We are here in July of 85. We have just made a new faction. Uh, high score folded last week, ended with a triple threat match between the prominent members. And now we already have Millionaire Mansion, so I want to make a new faction that could match them like for like. So obviously we've got Flawless as the singles and the leader. We've got the tag team of Rick and Tycoon and then the female of Dollar. So we've now got Ace Arcadian, who won the triple threat, is creating his own faction now. He has got the Neon Express alongside him as their tag team. And then Starbright will be their female representative. They are now called Max Energy. These guys are retro, they're neon, they're ready to roll. Max Energy, let's go. So that is our new faction here. We are going to pick, it's got to be ladies night. Uh, so it's going to be a women's battle royal, a three on three. So maybe that's where the factions come into it, maybe? In fact, almost definitely that's what's going to be. A uh, tag team title match. I feel like we already know what's going to happen there. And then there's the ladies title match. So, finally, we're going to have a cruiserweight title match. The cruiserweights have done nothing for so long. Here, I want to go with a tag team match. Uh, Pay-per-views contenders. Right, Cruiserweight, let's get this done first. So, we were thinking of Hooligan, Arizona. Let's throw Hooligan in there first. What's he actually done? Uh, beat Piranha, lost to Flawless, but beat Exile. He's had a good run. He's had a good enough run, so I'm happy with him to stay in there. Uh, let's give Death Star Boy a bit of a boost, though. Because I would like to see, I, I'd like to see his reign run on for a little bit longer. So we're going to do that. A uh, participant in this mic spot will face the tag team champions all month long. So this is where we have to work out how it's going to work. The Van Winkles and the Thompson Crew. Thompson Crew won tag team turmoil. Has to be them, right? Has to be them. So we need to go Otto, and then we need to go Stronger. But we need to remember that the Van Winkles are still in the mix. Alright, that's cool. So we've got a Cruiserweight match, finally. Here, we're going to put the Van Winkles in the mix. I think Terry was injured, wasn't he? Seven weeks! Are you crazy? Alright, Van Winkles are gonna have to. That's gonna have to be delayed then. Damn. Alright, so who else? Who else? Did we go to the Arcadium? And no, they're, they're done now. So let's book the Neon. Neon Express. And they get that bonus as well, which is excellent. Uh, we can't put them against the Thompson crew. Toxic Terror is a champion, so we don't want to do that. We could go Rock of Ages. Do you know what? We're going to put them against the Metalheads. Because I feel like we're feeding them to the Metalheads, which is kind of what I want. I want to build the Neons back up. Opener's match. We just want some random people here. Someone who can challenge Willy Mammoth next, perhaps. Uh, we're going to go Max. And we're going to go Thug. Nice. A ladies singles match. Is it too early to do Star Brian Dollar? No, I didn't see why not. So she's going to get that boost. And then we're going to go Starbright. And she's going to have the Professor in her corner. There we go. We are starting off this faction feud. Let's get it popping right there. 
Mid Carters. Mid Carters. Drool. We need to start using Drool more. Um, we can put him. I was going to say we could put him against one of the Van Winkles, but none of those are mid carders, unfortunately. Otherwise, that could have been a good way to keep that feud simmering for a bit. Um, again, we just need someone ready to put him over. Let's go. Let's go mercenary. Oh, that's fine. All right, that's that's all good. That's all good. Uh, we're going to go Canada. Fill the merch. Yep, sell all. Job done. Let's get it popping. Neon Express. We need Neons to start building back up. Now with this new faction boost they're getting, maybe it'll help them finally get themselves up there. Okay, nice win there. Remember, we still got the Van Winkles on the back burner. Four star segment. Nice. Very nice. Uh, Max and Thug. Max. He's had a very. He's been a lot busier. A lot more active than he's been for a while. But he's been a bit up and down. Uh, Dollar and Starbright. You would expect Dollar to win here, but Starbright win would be very nice. Because it's unexpected. No, Dollar's done it. So this should keep both of them out of the title picture while they're focusing on each other. Then we can build someone else up. Right, draw. We need to draw a win, really. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Two star is what it is. Thompson crew. They're back. They're going to try and get those titles. I might have to step in. How are you going to score? Oh, foul penalty. Right. Death Star Boy. Hooligan. He's done it. I did give him the push. I gave him push boost because I want him to... I want him to run with the title for a little bit. Right, so... The show started well, kind of ended a bit flat. It is what it is. It is what it is. Claim that. Right, here we're going to see Mammoth continue his... Uh, Shenanigans. Uh, we don't have a tag, so let's put a tag in there. Alright, so let's go again with the Neon Express. Let's try to give them slightly more formidable opponents. Don't want to put them against Rick and Tycoon just yet. But ideally we would like them to win. That that would be big match. It puts them at risk here. But you know, if they're gonna make they're either gonna make it or they're not. Triple threat, don't know what to do with that just yet. TV title match, who's the contenders? Robbins, Hooligan, Thunderbird. Nope, we're gonna continue what we were doing. He's gonna go up against openers. Working his way through the division. Uh, yeah, the draw, a loss and a loss. Max, attack. Max he won. Lost the triple threat. It's fine. Really mammoth there. I need to at least work out who he went up against last time. Where are you, mammoth? Hello, chaps. So he beat Jesse last time. Okay. I need to remember that. I need to remember who he's gone up against. Singles, singles, triple threat. So random. Honestly, so random. Oh, this is going to be that. Oh, well, that saves me the hassle. It's not going to let me use that feud on both matches, unfortunately. What to do with the triple threat, though? 
Sure, let's, uh, let's just find a feud. That's big, but I can't afford Jet to lose. Okay. We really need Malice to start doing something, so that's, that's a bit different. Here, I think we just use this as a triple threat for people who haven't done anything yet. Who's not really had much of a chance to do anything so far? Chicano's only had a couple matches. Won the TV title match, lost it. Damon, we're going to let him sit out until his boy comes back. Dickie's been kind of quiet. We haven't done much with the dock. Let's put dock in there. Pierre has been very quiet. He's been on a losing streak. It's two to Slash Master in a row. Flawless. We need to keep him. What's his push? 14. He's going to struggle a bit. We haven't done nothing with Ginzu. Lost the Firewall 41 weeks ago. I think it's a wrap for him. We do have Tonga in the squad. But it's been too... Tonga, get in there, mate. Get in there. Right, let's get into kind of that level. We do have Leo! I forget my roster. That's what I'm doing. Go on, Leo, get in there. Nice. So all we need now is the skits. I'm going to go dramatic promo, and it's going to be Zen, former world champion. Kind of struggling a little bit at the minute. Uh, we need pop. We've got two to the pop. Yep. Right, that's fine. This will be Chicago. Yeah, I'm not sure what to do with Zen now. Obviously, he doesn't have the faction anymore. Drop the world title. Well, I suppose he's still up there. I suppose he's still up there. We need a Neon Express win here, really. If this faction thing is going to keep going. Nice big win. Nice big win. Two stars. Alright, this is just kind of like let's 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 see if one of these three is gonna start moving on up. The dog done it! The dog's done it! Let's go. Zen, talk that talk. We need you back, brother. Four star four star! Malice on the up and up? Maybe. Surely Malice, right? Yes, he's got it. Major Malice, four star! <laughs> right, here we go. I mean, it's just a single, so it doesn't really matter, but it would be interesting if the Thompson crew can get one over on him a few times. No, 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 no! Mutant number eight says, mm. I'm just gonna, it's just gonna crack me up if Mammoth ends up losing one of these. No. Not this time. So he's beating Jesse, now he's beating Max. Working his way through the undercard. And he's got skill boost, which we also always like to see. Alright, what do we have here? Number one contenders matches for the world title. Oh, I don't know what to do about the world title. Valedictorian. He's had a few chances, lost. Zen, lost the belt, lost the number one contenders match. Vader's had a good run, Slash has had a good run. But that gives us heels and heels. Let's have a look at how good a run they've had. Vader. Beat Malice, beat Robin, beat Laser. Oh, that's a good run, people. That is a good run. And who did I say Slash Master? Slash lost the tag team match, beat Pierre, lost to Jet. So probably not, unfortunately, Slash. I know you're I know you're the man, but you're probably just a little bit below now. We don't have a babyface apart from Zen. 
I don't, even though Zen's my dude, I don't know if he deserves another shot, to be quite honest with you. Ace is not quite there, and we need him for the faction match. So we're going to leave him out. We could go Buzzsaw. He lost the triple threat, had a good promo, hasn't really had much opportunity, to be honest. i got to put my hands up to that. Valedictorian lost to Jet Set, beat Zen, won a triple threat, but he did lose the World Title, so I can't re No, I can't put him in, because he's not a defending champion. If he was a defending champion, it would have been a different story. Pierre has had dreadful, dreadful. I mean, he beat Mammoth, but two losses on the banks to Slash Master. Not good news. Flawless, we need for. He's already lost to Vader, lost to Jet Set, lost to Rumble. He's lost a lot, Laser. Come on. And we can't use Zen either. Alright, so it's going to be Vader or someone's going to get an opportunity. Someone fresh. Flex has probably already had too much chance. We could go Malice. He's already lost to Vader recently, though. Hooligan. Ranger, would that be a kind of bit weird? He's only had one match lost. Mm -hmm. This is actually quite difficult to choose someone. Particularly if I'm trying to stick with it being a babyface. Flex, lost to Robin, lost to Jet Set, lost to Flawless. Two and four for the, uh, for the Federation history. Thunderbird has lost a bunch. Oh, we're struggling to find some decent baby faces there. Devin lost a tag, won a tag, won a tag. We've tried the Van Winkles on singles before though, it just didn't work. I could go Chicano. I could go Chicano. Unfortunately, Chance doesn't deserve it. This is a really difficult to find someone here, because I'm tied into this faction feud otherwise ace might have been a shout flawless might have been a shout can i really go down as far as mid card babyface mid card i don't think i can no i can oh man i'm not sure if chicano deserves it you know he's the one i'm leaning towards but i don't know if he deserves it won the tv title lost the tv title why is it so hard to find someone? I mean, I might just have to go bustle. He's just lost a cruiserweight title match. Oh, this is hard, people. This is actually hard. Do you know what? I'm throwing him in there. I'm going to throw him in there. It's random. It's out there, but... Let's go. And to be honest, Vader is kind of the one I want in there anyway. We've got a three on three again. Oh, God. I need some people to stand up. Zen, you're kind of... Well, you are singles now, essentially. So let's see if you can... Hold up. Do some work. He's one that triple threat. But he is a heel. Let's put him against Zen. If he can beat Zen, then that's big for the dog. Let's be fair. Big for the dog. Three on three tag. Oh, it's going to be these guys. So we're going to use draw 100%. Oh, man. Oh, man. Because he is their guy. And then Thompson Crew. Who would I normally put there? Normally Jet Set, to be honest. You know, let's give him Chicano because he needs to do something. He needs to do something. Can I have a Thompson crew? No, not today. Oh. Tag team rivals. Yes, they are. They absolutely are. All right, so we've got a mic spot and a skit. Skit. We're going to go back to Buzzsaw. Build him back up. Just through the skits. Mm -hmm. 
guys. And Mike Spot. I want flawless. I want flawless. So their guy is boss, millionaire mansion bonus, lovely jubbly. This should be back in Canada. Fill the merch, call it a day. <laughs> you know what is popping? What's going on? Get in there. Get in. Oh, look what is merch? Woo! Right, big match here. Whoever wins this moves on up the ladder. The other one will probably fade away for a few weeks. Alright, Zen said he's not happy to uh, slip out of the world title picture just yet, which is fine. I know he's my favourite, but I don't, I don't want to over push him if he doesn't deserve it. But if he's gonna rack up the wins, that's absolutely fine. Right, Thompson Crew, uh, Toxic Terrors or Toxic Trio in this case. And then obviously we've got the two factions that are going to be going at it next week on the pay per view. Chicano and the Thompson crew. I kind of like that, you know. I kind of like it. Ooh, Thompson crew now. Do you know what? The, the Toxic Terrors have lost a couple matches. They've lost a couple matches now. It just happens to be when the titles are not on the line. If Reptile wins here, it's going to be so weird. But I did feel like... Having a bit of a surprise entry might have been the thing. We're going to have a heel versus heel in the title match. It is what it is because he is the only person who kind of deserves that at the moment. We have an injury to draw. Oh dear. Right. Uh, cadaver and yes, that's fine. Right. Women's Battle Royal, always fun. Always fun. Ladies title match is going to be the winner of the Battle Royal. Like that. World title match. We we can probably give that a stipulation. Because they've definitely done battle over the years. Tag team title match. Toxic Terrors, Thompson Crew. Basically, the two strongest tag teams we've ever had. Going up against each other, so that's, that's just money. Here, we want the two factions, so we need Ace. And we need the Neon Express. So I need Chet. And I need Jesse. Yep, max energy bonus. Uh, managers, they have the Professor, I want to say. Yes. And then this here will be the other faction. Where are we going to go? Flawless? Where are you, where are you at, Flawless? It's like, it's like I've really forgotten my ABCs. What the hell's going on here? Uh, so it was Flawless, um, Rick, and Tycoon. There we go. My brain's just kicking into gear. Rick. Mr. Tycoon. Let's not uh, fall for that trap again. And then we've got the manager, which is the big boss junior. Beautiful. No feuds to be had, but that's fine. There we go. Faction versus faction. Let's see who steps up. We have a one on one match. Could go. Could go Zen and Buzzsaw. Whoever wins will obviously have a load of momentum going forward. That's big. That is big. Uh, we can use males on the two things here. So we are going to go. Uh, it has to be a male wrestler, I think. Shall not let's go. Legendary Valid Swim. Let's let him speak. We've not done much with him, actually. Uh, on the mic, is it evil? For Mike, yes. Let's let him speak. And for the skit, I want Slash Master, so we're gonna go creepy vignette. I want Slash to do his thing. Slash Master. 
Oh, where's he gone? Is he not there? Injured? Slashmaster injured? Nope, he's not. He's right there. Excellent. Uh, we just want a pop boost of two, which is you. Thank you. Right, the Battle Royal. This is going to be difficult. Uh, I think we're back in silver for this one. Uh, do the merch ones, we've got the ladies booked. Uh, you can use retired wrestlers in this match. I don't think we have any, but good to know. Right, who do we actually have here? Alpha! Let's get you involved. Dollar. And I think we'll go star bright there. First entrant is going to be the queen, because she's won a few of these. Um, what about Queen starting things off against Minx? Okay. Uh, we're gonna go with Sparks, Voodoo. Do I have enough women? Tiki. Yes, I do. So Countess, Gothica, Russia. There's too many. I need to. I need to really think about this. I think Sparks probably needs to come out. Succubus, Sparks, Shipley. I think Shipley in Russia should probably be in. I think that's fair. I think that's fair. Well, that's cool. That's cool. Fill up the merch. Yeah, Alpha. Flawless. Starbright. Zen. Beautiful. Big battle royal. Oh, Mix, Mix straight out. What the hell? What the hell happened there? Mix just got shot straight out. Dollar's gone. That's kind of big. Russia as well. Two of our biggest names straight out. Queen's hanging in there. I notice. I'd like to see Alpha get back in the top picture. To be honest. I'll just be quiet. No way Queen is winning this from the number one position, surely. Queen of Mean from the number one position wins the Battle Royal. Hot damn. Here we go. Faction versus Faction. Millionaire's Mansion versus whatever I named them. Max Energy, I think it was. I, I, I kind of like to see Max Energy win this, to be honest. I'm going to book them both strongly regardless. Okay, Millionaire's Mansion with the win. I need to get Flawless into the title picture. World title picture. Valedictorian, talk back talk. He's had a very... It's his debut year. He's been world champion once or twice. Done some good stuff. Let's keep him hot. Zen versus Buzzle. Who's going to be the top babyface moving forward? Wow, honestly, I was expecting Buzzle to win there. Zen is back in the picture. Let's go. Big time title match. Surely Thompson's are not going to take it. No. Toxic Terrors are back. They're back, baby. Uh, three star match as well. Very nice. Slash Master doing his thing. Uh, three star segment. Here we go. I mean, realistically, it should be Jet. I mean, Vader's got very little heat here. Woo! Unexpected World Championship change there. Can Queen be the one? No. No. Four star, though. Hell of a match. That was kind of from the number one position. Queen does it. Skill boost as well. Always nice to see. Injury in this one here. But Millionaire's Mansion do win. Valedictorian talks his talk. So we'll keep him around. Zen beats Buzzsaw. That's mental. Another injury in the tag team match. 
Slash Master talks his talk. Vader is the new world champion. And Linda retains. We're probably... That's probably the best women's match we've ever had. I would imagine it is. I would imagine that is. Crazy. So we have August next. Things are still heating up. Zen is on the comeback. Buzzsaw has blown his his bit of heat that he was generating. I don't know if Jet Set deserves a immediate rematch. How, did he have a success, one successful defense? I don't know. So it's going to be kind of these two. Valedictorians down there. Slash Masters around as well. Lots going on. People, thank you very much for watching Revenant Legends. See you again. Peace.